And I must say, this stadium falls and they must visit category for any football fan should the chance come his or her way. Anfield is the venue. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Liverpool, and they take on Arsenal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Jude Bellingham. And Hoybier with it. Ficayo Tomori. Really good challenge. Firing it towards goal. Well, they'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Goal news to bring you from the Aston Villa game, and Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for Chelsea. They're the first on the score sheet here with 12 minutes on the clock. Alex, thank you very much. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. But nothing comes of it. Oh, it's an own goal! A moment he would love to be able to forget. Well, as you can see, it came off him last. And as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. One nil then. Gabriel Martinelli. Martinelli. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And teammates around him. And a fine cross. Well, flinging himself at it. Can someone get on the end of this? Oh, good save. Excellent header. Corner again. And no problems at all for the keeper. And Bellingham. And Diaz has it. Chance to cross. Out for a Liverpool throw. And delivered into the box. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Not giving him a moment's peace. Arsenal finding space on the wing. Options in the middle. Into the advanced position. Marcinelli. On to Jesus. Magnificent defending. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Crossed accurately towards the far post. Could be. And look at that. A goal here for Arsenal, who now have got themselves on terms. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And then just look at this finish, Derek. He does so well to read the bounce. Often you can send these into row Z, but he makes the perfect contact. Stunning goal, really. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Poor pass. Hoybier. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Oh, he saved it well. 
Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Great pressure to win the ball back. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. Well, still an issue here. And the cross smuggled away. Barella. And now with Estupinian. An awful lot of green space to run into. Barella. On to Jesus. A chance then for the respective managers to address their job. Well, they've kicked off the second half here at Anfield. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. And possession lost, intercepted. Promising sequence. Must be! And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plumb. It's a great goal. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Barella. Could cross it in here. Preferring to go infield. Shot attempted and blocked for now. Good looking sequence. Oh dear. Well, that's not one that's going to linger long in the memory. Well, he had a go there. Nothing wrong with that. But he's got that all wrong. And we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Liverpool facing Nottingham Forest. That looks a really entertaining game. Two good teams with two excellent coaches. I can't wait for that one to come round. And the keeper caught there. Corner kick played in. And the danger still on. And Bellingham. And this situation could be dangerous. Still looking to get the shot off. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Well, somebody has scored, I'm hearing, in the Villa game. But who exactly? Alex will tell us. It's a goal for Villa. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 67 minutes played. Thanks, as always, Alex. Rodrigo. And Hoybier with it. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV. And looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Arsenal facing Crystal Palace. This might be ideal for the counter. Defenders need to cover. Individual brilliance. Could be! And a decent save. Full credit. Moving forward effectively. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. And they deal with the threat this time. Well, almost at full time. Liverpool desperate to make this a victory. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've certainly controlled the tempo of the game and just about deserved their lead. But they've got to keep their concentration right to the end here. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. But they took care of the situation defensively.
five minutes left. And space to cross it. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So back underway, 3-1 the score. So two minutes of stoppage time here. And Bellingham. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, no end product. And Bellingham. Grimaldo. Oh, surely. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, let's take another look. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? It's a great turn and shot. What a good goal that is. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. Well, it was a 